All right, today we're going to demo for you a Royal Master Centerless Grinder. Uh, this one is equipped with an automatic infeed unit, and the machine is obviously set up for infeed grinding. Now, that means that we're going to be introducing a part. We're going to come in, we're going to grind it, it's going to open up. In the case of an automatic cycle, it's going to eject the part, and maybe you're going to have some kind of a loader uh, loading parts in, or you could just manually load parts in on your own. Um, so you've got your over-the-wheel dressers. Uh, it's a high-precision dresser on these machines, uh, hydraulic uh, to bring it across. The adjustment here for your diamond. Uh, over here you would adjust the speed of the, of the travel. It's adjustable. Uh, you, can, you put a template in here. You can indicate on this to get it nice and straight. Uh, this is all done uh, factory uh, service. We got lubrication for each dresser, individual lubrication for each dresser. Uh, this does have a cooling system, which is in our photos in, on our website. Um, so it's running right now. You saw the hydraulic uh, portion of it, which is just the dressers. Everything else is uh, everything else is pneumatic and mechanical. So um, here we saw our spindle, our coolant, and our hydraulics, which everything is on. Down here we could change uh, the speed of the regulating wheel and we have a, a, a tachometer or readout for the RPMs. Uh, mounted on the side over here, if we want to bring the, maybe bring the camera over. Oh, let's just, I'll show you a quick cycle. I hit this button and slide shoots forward and then starts to feed. You see the indicator going around. Now you can adjust how much it feeds, how fast it feeds, where it starts the, the fast from the slow, anything you want. We'll do that again. The whole machine is kind of modular. All these parts can be adjusted uh, depending on the type of grinding you're doing. Your work rest blade can slide in and out. The whole uh, bottom half of this can move in and out to accommodate bigger and smaller parts. Um, you can put it on angles for through feed grinding where you want to pull the part through between the wheels. Uh, we have an automatic cycle here which if you put it in automatic, uh, that would be if you had a loader set up and you were ejecting the part and putting a new one in and ejecting the part and putting a new one in. And it's, it's all timed but you can, you can adjust all that timing. How long it uh, sparks out for, how long before the next cycle starts. So it just gives it enough time to drop a new part in there and the old part to drop out. The way I have it set right now. It's kind of quick. But just for the video. And if you want to see what's going on, we can take a walk over here to the back while I have this cover off. This is the automatic uh, infeed system. Now fine size and actual adjustment of the size would still be done by making fine adjustments here on the machine's actual infeed in screw. So this is all tuned up and working perfectly. Uh, the machine is currently wired for 220 volts. And that's it. That's the Royal Master Centerless Grinder. It's a model TG4, 12 by 4, a 12 inch grinding wheel, 4 inch diameter maximum part. Well, the four inch diameter uh, with wheels, excuse me, not four inch diameter parts, but four inch uh, width of the grinding wheels. There's also a TG3, and only accept a three inch wheel. So there you have it. Thank you very much.